What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be doing a short and sweet tutorial on penalties and how to get Neymar as fast as possible. Never miss a penalty with a couple of key tips. Let's get straight into it. Roll it! Alright lads, so as you probably know by now, this free mini game is part of the daily login bonus now. So as soon as you can log in and you connect to the servers, every 24 hours when you get your login bonus, you will also be able to take a penalty. It's pretty easy, right? I've been playing across four different profiles. I haven't really missed yet. If you are struggling, right, do not panic. If you've missed one, do not panic. You will still get Neymar. It will just take you a little bit longer. But you might as well score as many as you possibly can and get Neymar quicker, right? So I'm going to show you my first penalty and then we're going to break it down right here. So I haven't missed using this technique yet, but I'm also going to show you some variety with the placement that we picked across my different profiles on the penalties, just to try different things out. But you will see where I've got the aim and direction here, where it's kind of between the goalkeeper and the post, okay? As I'm deciding to kind of power up, I'm going to be dragging this left, okay? I'm going to be dragging it more towards the post. I'm not going to go fully in the corner, because sometimes I have seen a couple of people that have missed when the goalkeepers really do stretch out. It's rare, but it can happen. I'd say there's probably an 80% conversion ratio. Uh, even if the goalkeeper chooses the right way, he won't reach it, okay? So it does really, it is really kind of... Um, easy to score these right there's no real you know magical uh type of way of doing them but i haven't missed using this first this technique whereas basically uh, as i broke it down there you just pick a corner and then you obviously commit to it and try and get as much to full power as possible while not overshooting it okay so when we are when we are taking it with castolo um who's left footer i would usually drag it across the goals and just try and get it as much in the corner as possible this is literally aiming at the full corner either left or right it doesn't really matter which condition that you do it in and you will see that it's just stuck into into the back of the corner right of the net there okay even if you go central like this i know a lot of people are saying go down the middle i've actually seen the goalkeeper on a couple of clips from people on the discord and stuff where the goalkeeper just stands in the middle and catches it okay so again i would always pick a corner and i would always boost up as much power as possible yes you can still still score with these but if the goalkeeper picks the right direction um to jump it, it, it can save it and you see there right that's a perfect example where he didn't save it even though he went the right the direction because i had the full power right but yeah he will not move a lot of the time if he does you're just a bit unlucky okay if you go down the middle so as i said what i usually do is from this direction here i will pick it right in between the goalkeeper and the post kind of just over the player's shoulder either his left or right shoulder depending on what side you want to go and then all you're going to do is as you strike the ball you're going to go as much power as possible and drag the shot into the left corner so that's all i do every time and it seems to work even if the goalkeeper picks the right uh, place to jump okay so that is it let's just another short and quick video hopefully this helps you out don't forget to like and subscribe peace